Good morning, everybody. So our Y family workout today, the word is zippity doo dah. Needed to get some other letters in. So Z is going to be your favorite letter for these workouts. It's actually a 10 second rest. So you might need some weights today. You don't have to, but if you have even a couple of water bottles, because I know not everybody has access to some weights. If you have some dumbbells, great, grab them. And if you don't, that's okay also. So I'm just gonna use, I'm gonna show you both because I have a, actually I'll just leave this off to the side. Um, two different, two different um, water bottles, but they're more or less the same size. So you can use two different water bottles or I have four pound weights. So starting with just a little bit of a warm up, let's start with high knees and marching. Just in case you've rolled out of bed. I've been up for a little while today. So just moving the arms also. A lot of times we get into running or walking with just doing these bicep curls right next to us. You want to actually swing the elbows side to side. So let's go ahead and just touch the toes. Straight legs. You don't have to go very high yet. And then let's just go behind, bringing the heel behind and staying nice and tall when you do this. Good. Taking a nice deep breath in, open up, exhale, inhale in, exhale out, and then just a little side to side just to try to get everything away this morning. Good. So we're going to start with our 10 second rest. And what we're going to do is we're just going to concentrate on a little bit of breathing. So we'll start the workout. So go ahead and either get your weights or your water bottles. I know one will fly, really be fine. And let's start with a 10 second breath. So let's inhale. And exhale. You want to feel your rib cage lift. One more time. Good. Okay, so that was your letter C, favorite letter. And the I is next, and it's going to be 20 jumping jacks. So, if you're not quite ready to get that body moving, you don't have to raise your arms all the way up. You can also keep them bent. But if you're ready, let's do this. Second letter is I, and zippity doo da. 20 jacks. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good. Okay, we've got 15 push ups. Our first P, actually, it's our only P today. So I've got my mat folded in half. You can use it as a guide to take your pinkies to each edge. And I'm going to use the mat as my guide for my hands and scoop my knees back. And we've got 15 push ups. Push your hands into the ground and let's go. I'm going to turn my head side to side. I should get as low as I possibly can. Here we go 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. And let's go 15 bicycles. So you don't have to go very far. 15 bicycles. Rolling right onto your back. Remember, I count twice. So I say one, one, two, Two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten, eleven, eleven, twelve, twelve, thirteen, thirteen, fourteen, fourteen, fifteen, fifteen, sixteen, sixteen, seventeen, seventeen, eighteen, eighteen, nineteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty,
13, 13, 14, 14, 15, 15. Good. And D is the next letter. This is where you want to grab your water bottles, nothing, or your dumbbells. So I'm going to start with just tension in my muscles. 15 bicep curls for D. You want to have the elbows under the shoulders. There's three, four, five. I'm going to grab my water bottles. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then if you want dumbbells, we can go five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so we've got two E's coming up in zippity. You can use the dumbbells, use the water bottles, or nothing at all. So I'm just going to start in reverse, start with the dumbbells. Get down into your half squat position, first set of 15. Five, four, three, two, one. I am feeling these workouts from the past few days. Grab your bottles. Five, four, three, two, one. And then we have nothing. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Okay, shake it up. We're going to do that one more time. Do the math. Count how many reps you're doing today. I'm going to start with nothing and move my way backwards. We've got five, four, three, keep down this and low, two, one, four balls, five, four, three, two, one. Yes, they do have water in them. And then we've got the dumbbells, five, four, three, two, one. Good. So you just did 30 rows. Nice job. D, bicep curls. Let's start with five, just by using the tension in our arms, back, core, and pushing your feet right into the ground and making sure your feet are actually straight and lined up. Five, four, three, two, one. And then I've got the dumbbells. Five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. Okay, so lunges. Again, I've got my mat set up for you so you can actually see where your feet are supposed to be. So from the front, remember, you want to have some space between the legs. You don't want to seem like you're balancing on a balance beam. You want to have space. The back heel is going to be lifted. We're going to count 10 on each side. So try to take the back leg back as far as you can, lifting that back heel. It's not a rocking, because this just takes it right into this front knee. It's actually a back knee going to the floor. I'm going to keep my hands out of the way this morning and just keep my fingers laced right around my ponytail. And we've got 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good. Other side. So I stepped up. I have about 4 or 5 inches between my feet. And by the way, these lunge rules are for any time you're doing lunges. Okay, let's do 10 on the other side. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good. Shake out your legs. If you want to hang on to your water bottles, or your weights, just to add a little bit of overload to those legs. Go for it. 
Zippity do that. That's two O's. So we have another set of lunges. Ten on each side. How many lunges did you just do? Or will we be doing by the end? All right. Here we go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Check out this knee. Back knee goes down to the floor. And then ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Carefully, you're not swinging. Three, two, one. So much about getting good workouts is keeping the integrity of your body and keeping tension through the muscles. Just as an FYI. All right, so we did our lunges. Two sets for our two O's. We have a D, A, and an H left. 15 bicycles. So back down to the floor. Let's do some straight leg bicycles just so we can keep things mixed up. So straight legs, and we're gonna go 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Perfect. All right. And now, 30 seconds of high knees. Finishing with a little bit of cardio here. High knees, I like to have my hands out in front. You can always modify and just lift in the knees. Just try not to bend forward with each one. So arms are up. 30 seconds of high knees. We're going to start on the clock in three, two, and one. Here we go. I keep my hands out just as a target. If anything, even if you can't get there, your brain is telling your body to try to reach your hands. So in case your hands are lowering, look what happens. Everything gets low. So keep your hands out, high in front. Your body has to work a little bit harder. Three, two, and one. Good, nice job. Grab a drink if you need it. Your word today was zippity doo -dah. Thanks for working out with me. Have a good one.